Getting ahead of 99% of computer science majors is simple. It's not easy, but it is simple. Step one is just being consistent. You just need to show up every day, say what you're gonna do, and then actually do that thing. You need to practice regularly because most people don't even care enough to practice. And if you do, you'll be better than like 95% of people right off the bat. Whether this is coding or leap code or working out at the gym or doing anything else, you just need to practice consistently every single day. But what do you decide to be consistent about? Well, unfortunately, step number two is lead code and you need to get good at data structures and algorithms and you need to get good at lead code because these are the questions that companies ask you in interviews and if you want to get one of those great jobs you need to be good at lead code even if it has nothing to do with your day-to-day -day job so just go watch all the lead codes videos grind lead code really understand what you're doing practice it consistently and you will be good three do not be afraid to ask questions ask questions whenever you're feeling kind of stuck on something ask your friends ask your classmates ask your teachers ask your tas ask people on the internet but when you are asking these questions make sure to ask them clearly if you're dming someone online say hi here's my question don't say hi, I have a question, because then that slows everybody down. Be direct, be concise, be kind, and people will be very, very willing to help you. Step four is not asking questions. Just read the documentation before you start working on a project, whether this is the documentation for a code base you're contributing to, or a programming language or framework that you're trying to use for a new project, Read the documentation kind of well beforehand so that when you run into a bug, you kind of know what's causing it already without having to do much, too much research. You should be struggling with these questions yourself. You should be trying to answer them yourself before you ask people for help because things that you discover through your own experience will always stick around a lot longer than something that somebody else just tells you. Step number five is recognizing that your GPA doesn't matter. Of course, you need to get a decent GPA, but you don't need to do a ton of work to get a decent GPA. Aim to do the bare minimum to get an A and sometimes you'll get a B, but that will will be okay. There's a lot of better things you can be doing with your time that you would be spending to try and get a hundred on homework or an assignment. You could be building side projects, learning new things, doing leak code, talking to new people, doing cool things, having fun. All of these are better uses of your time than struggling to get a 95 instead of a 93. Don't over optimize on your grades. Step number six is recognizing that competition is greater than collaboration. Even though the title of this video is how to get ahead of 99% of computer science majors, you should be focusing on collaborating with your peers and not directly competing against them even though you technically are for a bunch of different jobs. These people are all intelligent just like you and they all want to do cool things. So work with them on side projects, have fun, just be friends with them, just enjoy your time. Because at the end of the day when you do go work at a software engineering job you're usually not going to be working solo. You're going to be working with a team of like six to seven other people and you need to be able to learn how to collaborate with them and not see them as competition. See them as human beings. Step number seven is mass apply to jobs. Your first internship and your first job require you to apply to a ton of jobs. It's just a matter of statistics, which kind of sucks, but you can help boost your chances in a few different ways. Those friends you just made that you collaborated with, maybe they know someone at the company that you can ask for a referral, or you can get on LinkedIn and ask for referrals. If you ask for referrals, mass apply to jobs, and you're ready for your lead code interviews, you will be fine. Most importantly though, you're probably majoring in computer science because you like it at least a little bit. So do not forget to actually have fun with what you're learning. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope this helped. If it did, hit that like button, leave a comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.